Turning to some economic news now, and April was another sturdy, solid month for Korean exporters. The trade balance has now been in the black for 27 straight months. And on top of that, sectors that didn't fare so well last year are bouncing back extremely strongly. Song ji Son reports. Korea posted a 27th consecutive monthly trade surplus in April and more importantly it resulted from improvement in most export industries. With the exception of LCD panels, key export items demonstrated strong growth, even steel and petroleum products, which suffered from a slump last year. Deliveries of high-value added vessels, like drill ships, helped place the shipping industry at the top in terms of export growth. Traditional export engines like semiconductors and handsets also saw an expansion thanks in part to the launch of Samsung's new Galaxy S5 model. The nation's trade surplus stood at four and a half billion U.S. dollars in April, with outbound shipments surpassing the 50 billion dollar mark for the second time in history. Last month's export figure of 50.3 billion dollars is up 9 percent from the same month last year, while imports rose 5 percent to 45.9 billion dollars. By region, exports to U.S. rose 19 percent in April, another sign that the U.S. economy is recovering at a robust pace. Outbound shipments to ASEAN countries and Japan also gained ground, but slowed to European nations and China. Trade officials said, however, the large surplus in April was partly because exporters expedited shipping and customs clearances in April before the holidays in the first week of May. Looking to the month ahead, Slower growth is possible due to a fewer number of working days. Song Ji-sun, Arirang News.